converting a fraction with a denominator of 10, 100, or 1,000 to a decimal. Uh, seems like we're being pretty specific here saying that we want a particular problem type that only has these as a denominator. But that's because there's kind of a shortcut whenever we have one of these as a denominator, such as our example, 56 over 100, that we're asked to write as a decimal. The thing to remember with these problem types is our place values. If we have some sort of a number and it has a decimal in it, and maybe it's got some places behind the decimal, these place values out here, you may recall, are tenths and hundredths and thousandths. And we could keep going, you know, ten thousandths, etc. But since these are the names of the place values out here, that's going to help us to actually place the decimal in the right place without having to go through any really lengthy conversion process. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that 56 hundredths, and since it does have one of these special denominators, 10, 100, or 1,000, our process is to first of all just drop that denominator. So forget about the 100 but we are going to have to use the 100 to figure out where to place the decimal I've got my digits the 5 and the 6 but I need to know where to place the decimal so I use that 100 and I remember that the hundredths place is this one right here it's the second one after the decimal so the 5 6 that I have here that means that the last digit whatever it is in this case the 6 has to be in the hundredths place. That has to be in the hundredths place. And this again goes back to the fact that my denominator is a hundred. So if I have those numbers, the five and the six, and I need the six to be in the hundredths place, the decimal must be here because that would put the five in the tenths place and the six in the hundredths place. This would be our decimal answer. 0.56 and again another way of saying that would be 56 hundredths that's the way that we would say this decimal which happens to also be the way that we would say the fraction 56 hundredths is 56 hundredths